Good morning, David here with his weekly week look and as usual we are using the November UK wheat as our base chart. I'll just bring that up for you and as you can see um, during this week we've had prices fall back after a test of 171. This is on the November UK which is uh, nearly was the spot month um, and as you can see we are still in this distribution pattern uh, which has been through August, September and now into October. And as last week's, um, I was indicating to you that this Castic is working very well in this sideways market action at giving you a sell and buy signals um, of what, what the price is going to do in the current situation. And as you can see here, at the beginning of October, we had a buy signal when the Castic crossed from the low reading of naught and started to rise. And this was marked here on the uh, on the daily chart. You can see that quite clearly. And as you can see, our top recent top of 171 has taken place, and now we're getting a sell single on the on the stochastic, indicating the price can fall back to 159, which is the 20-day moving average, which is the sort of halfway point of this sideways pattern. If that doesn't hold, then we see prices falling back to 148. Um, as you can see, this previous moves have been sort of in a span of sort of one to two weeks. So obviously that's what we're looking at uh, for this down leg at the present moment. Um, on the longer term perspective, I am getting a little concerned that, that we have now tested this high of 171 three times and failed to break through it, uh, which is starting to get a little bit concerning. Uh, that there is obviously a firm resistance there at 171 on the November. By, by turn this round on its head, if we did see a, uh, the market then go back up to retest this 171 and then break through, that would be a very bit bullish signal. And obviously, um, the fourth time of testing um, obviously normally indicates that this resistance at the top will give way. But obviously, at the moment, we're seeing prices fall back um, down to test the support again. And as usual, just show the spot month at the moment. Uh, sorry, not the spot month. This is May 2011. And as you can see, uh, the price action of the last two days, by the, as indicated by the red candles, has fallen back. At present, we are live trading 169.40. And in fact, we are up a little bit on the day. So it's sort of it's sort of 50-50 uh, whether we could fall further or whether maintain this uh, you know pattern around the 169 level for today and early part of next week. Um, but obviously, as usual, the two lines we're looking at is the top top and the base uh, to give you an indication of that. Um, and just to show you the Chicago wheat at the moment. This is uh, CBOT, Chicago wheat in America. And as you can see, uh, we had this big green candle here, which is the rise of the USDA crop report last week. And since then, the market has just been gradually drifting back. And at the moment, it's $705 at the present moment. So as usual, I'll put an update for next week. And obviously, uh, keep an eye on those uh, support and resistance levels. Thank you.